in the mosaic of legendary entities, Sasquatch emerges. A cryptic figure steeped in the shroud of whispers and tales. An enigmatic being whose colossal frame and elusiveness have woven themselves into the very fabric of our myths and folklore. Then we have Godzilla, an emblematic titan whose cinematic journey dates back to the 1950s. An enduring presence that traverses generations, an embodiment of both terror and allegory. King Kong, regal in his cinematic prowess since the inaugural 1933 film, an iconic silhouette that looms large within the annals of cinematic history, a testament to the enduring appeal of grandiose narratives. The Loch Ness Monster, an enigma nestled in the cradle of Scottish lore, its very existence veiled in the whispers of intrigue and speculation, an embodiment of the cryptid mysteries that tantalize the human imagination. Venture further and find goblins, playful yet capricious, navigating the realms of fable and mythology with their impish antics, forever embracing the whimsical margins of fantastical narratives. Ghoul, a spectral apparition from Arabic folklore that roams the haunted corridors of supernatural lore, consuming human flesh, an incarnation of dread and phantasmal terror. And finally, the zombie, an entity bereft of life's essence, adrift in the desolate landscapes of post-apocalyptic motifs, a hollow shell devoid of consciousness. What unites this disparate ensemble, these figures from the annals of the extraordinary, the supernatural, the mythic? What is a man? The chorus of concurrence resounds. My presence, an indomitable force, a monster within the cultural tapestry, an enduring emblem within the kaleidoscope of societal narratives, a resonant echo through the corridors of our collective